it to him, do it to him, do it to him, do it to him. He gon' love it when I do it to him, do it to him, do it to him, do it to him. I'm such a flex, so he gon' lose it when I. I'm about to go live with Harrods Beauty. I'm going to connect Molly here. Let's see here. And see if this works. How's everyone doing today? I'm up here in my little office. <laughs> Just dropped my uh, gorgeous son Hart off to preschool for his second day of preschool. He was quite happy today and yesterday he had a couple of little tears bless and um, let's see here go live hopefully this is working anyway let's see Molly's saying she's requested Go live in the room with Harrods Beauty. We are going to be chatting today. Harrods Beauty is unable to join. Mm. Requests. Harrods Beauty. Where are you, Molly? Technology, and I don't even think Mercury's in retrograde. Is oh, it Mercury? Hi, yes. Yes. We hi, it. Panda, how are you? There's always a technical issue, isn't there? It's, oh, we, always the way. There's always something, but that's all right. It is We're here now. Is. We're here um, now. Lovely to see you. Lovely how to you? see you. This is so exciting. I've been so looking forward to chatting to you and finding out all about your amazing brand. I've been using everything, and I'm completely hooked. Oh, thank you. Yeah, this is my um, baby girl. I was just talking about how I dropped my second child, my middle child, off to preschool this morning. Bless. Oh, and how was he? Was he okay? He was okay today. Yesterday, he was a little um, upset, like just had a couple of tears, and then he was fine after like, you know, 10 minutes or so. Oh. But today, he was like, bye, mom, I love you, and I gave him his little kissing hand, and so cute. So sweet. And he held his little hand like this because I like put a kiss in his hand and he was like, okay. Oh, but no, no tears though, but he was, he was fine straight off. Not today. Good. Today he was like straight off. So that was great. Oh, amazing. Well, I'm, I've got so many questions to ask you and we've been sent so many questions in um, because oh, everyone just wants to know everything about the range. And obviously it's now stocked at both our H Beauty stores, which is really exciting. But I thought I'd just kick things off by asking you what inspired you to create this range back in 2006, was it? Um, that was the concept, yeah. yes, that I launched in Australia in 2009. Okay, amazing. Yeah. So for me, my mum, when I was 16, she actually um, got sick. She was diagnosed with cancer in her spleen. So as a family, we had to look through everything we were using on our hair, on our skin, what, what household cleaning products we were using <clears throat> that could have potentially been contributing to her illness. Mm -hmm. And also we were looking at any packaged goods and just we were reading every little ingredient. And we were just really surprised to see that there were some potentially carcinogenic ingredients that were just like readily available. So um, we started looking for cleaner alternatives with everything throughout our whole home through cleaning products through hair care through skincare and whatnot 
And I wasn't able to find anything that was actually truly organic and really powerful. And for my job, I needed something powerful and really results driven and clinically active. And I had been in the industry for um, quite some time and I'd been trying different products on my skin and different textures. And I had said to, and I tried everything out there. And I said to a friend of mine in 2006, I was like, oh, I don't understand why someone hasn't made something that's actually purely certified organic, really results driven. And, and um, she said, why don't you speak to a friend of mine who makes certified organic essential oils and see what she has to say about the whole thing. And so I did. And then she put me in touch with the lab and the lab is still and the chemists and we that's how Cora Organics was born. I just had a conversation with them. I said, do you think it's possible to create really efficacious, results-driven, healthy products that are certified organic? And they were like, yeah, it's just a long process. And so it took three years of development back and forth with the labs, trying products. And in that time, my mom actually had rosacea on her face and I gave her the Noni Glow face oil and it completely healed her skin. And she was blown away and it was so great to see those results firsthand. Yeah. And I thought, well, I just want to give these products and make them available to everyone. And do you know what I think that's the most interesting thing is this Noni juice that I've been reading about that I hadn't really heard of before. Can you kind of um, expand a bit on that and, and what it is, where it comes from? Yeah, so Noni juice is a superfood, super fruit, and I've been drinking it since I was 13, and I really feel like it was the key to my health and, like, well-being, and we even used to give it to our dogs, and we had a, we had a dog, you know, that um, was a friend's dog that was had really bad arthritis, and we'd put a little Noni juice in the water, and then Within like two weeks, the dog was like bouncing around everywhere like it was a puppy again, like the arthritis had healed. And what's interesting about the Noni is it works on a cellular level to normalize any abnormal cells. Mm -hmm. So whether that's internally or externally on your skin. And so that's why when I was developing Cora, I wanted it to be the key ingredient across the range along with other super powerful ingredients um, that we use and I love the internal beauty mixed with the external beauty like all of the a lot of the ingredients for instance like in our turmeric scrub there's turmeric in there oh, that's my favorite can I just yes. say that is my favorite it's so and it's, beautiful and it's so good for you internally and externally like internally internally it's very anti-inflammatory and um, very soothing for the system and externally it's very brightening and it's it's also it's in our beautiful new turmeric moisturizer Ooh. as well i think that's the thing as well all the products are so shelfy friendly they're all so beautiful they look beautiful in the bathroom as well as being amazing for your skin they look great too Thank you. Yeah, I spent so much time on the packaging and I love all the new glass jars because you buy the glass jar once and then the refill pods thereafter so you've got less waste so it's better for the environment. So you just buy that little refill pod after and it just, the ingredients are what like blow my mind because I work with our chemists and I just feel so lucky to work with some of the best chemists in the world to create these really powerful products. Because I don't want to put something on my skin just because it's healthy. Yeah. I want it to be super results driven and gives you skin that glow that you need. And I think with all the products, there's such interesting ingredients. I mean, kakudu plum is it, a kangaroo yeah. cornflower. I mean, how do you go about finding all these incredible ingredients? So we're constantly working and, you know, we have a research and development team and they work together with our chemists and we just are on the cutting edge of finding products that are really powerful and results driven. So as you were saying, the Kakadu Plum is in our new vitamin C eye cream. And this has kakadu plum, which is the highest natural uh, source of vitamin C. My mom actually used to drink it, talking about internal and external. Yeah. She still drinks it as a powder. Um, yeah. 
and um, and it also has kangaroo paw flower, which is from Australia. It's a flower. But it's called the kangaroo paw flower because it looks like a kangaroo paw. <laughs> but it's really high in antioxidants. It's really great for strengthening the eye area. It also has cloudberry um, in here, which is high in vitamin C, hence it being called very bright. Yeah. And it has red ginseng in here and um, the other ingredient I'm trying to think of. Oh, quinoa peptide. And the quinoa peptide really helps with that delicate um, skin around the eyes becoming more uh, bright and their strength. So this eye cream is really great. It sits beautifully underneath makeup. I'm wearing it now. It's a super rich uh, yeah. eye cream. Oh, so I, I must have been, you know, I went for a facial the other day and they scanned my face and they're like, ooh, very dehydrated in the eye area. So I've been wearing this ever since. And honestly, guys, it's really, it's so hydrating. It's so luxurious. You've all got to get on board because it's a beaut. It's a real beaut. <laughs> It is. It's really great. And combined with the eye oil, it's the ingredients work synergistically together to really brighten and tighten and firm the eye area. So that eye oil is incredible because it has the rose quartz rollerball and it's super soothing and um, very energizing around the eye area. That has yeah. tomato fruit extract. It has kahai oil, which is like a natural retinol. Um, do you know what I've also done with this before? I've popped it in the fridge for a bit and then rolled it on under my eyes, and that's really it feels just really nice and soothing yes. um, under the eyes. So and the little gua sha that we have, which is a rose quartz um, gua sha, it's like a face sculptor. I haven't tried that yet. That looks lovely. Yeah. This is really great to kind of massage in like your face oil or your moisturizer and you can put this in the fridge to give it that extra Bit stimulation. Of... Yeah, I love it. And that. so can you just talk me and, and everyone through your kind of daily regime, um, daily morning regime with, with the products and the way you'll layer them and et cetera, et cetera. Cause I'm very interested to know. I want to know everything because your skin is absolutely amazing. <laughs> Oh, thank you. A 38-year-old mother with two, uh, three boys running around the house, two little babies, uh, well, like two and three-year-old. Um, <laughs> they keep me on my toes, let me tell you. Yeah, I bet they do. <laughs> yeah, so I make sure that I do my skincare routine in the morning before they wake up and then at night when they're already asleep because then I have that little zen time to myself to just yep. really rejuvenate and, like, have that moment. And I believe that... Basically, this is a moment for yourself where you can take care of yourself, your mind, your body, and your skin. And yeah. so that's why all of Cora products in the manufacturing process touch upon rose quartz crystals. Mm -hmm. So they're energized with that loving energy. Yeah. And rose quartz crystals are a tool that I've used in my life that, and, and crystals in general that really have, you know, helped me through like the madness of my life. So anyway, I wake up. I dry body brush my whole body all over to get the lymphatic system going and just mm -hmm. feel a little more energized. I have a lemon With water. The oil. <laughs> There's the body oil. It's incredible, that body oil. Yeah, no, I've been trying that too. Beautiful. Yes, it's so good. It melts into your skin and really just, it's so good. I've used it throughout all three of my pregnancies. It helped prevent stretch marks. It also helps the appearance of stretch marks as well, um, if you have any. So, and then jump in the shower, I use our Milky Mushroom Gentle Cleansing Oil, which is an incredible um, experience. You have to shake it to activate and mix all of the ingredients. So yeah, this one's really lovely. Into this really beautiful milky texture. And I do a couple of squirts and just cleanse my skin. And what I love is that it's not a heavy oil-based cleanser. It's more of like a lightweight cleanser yeah. i wanted it to cleanse the skin but not leave any residue afterwards mm -hmm. okay and that's why the milky mushroom is so good it contains silver ear mushroom which is even um 
stronger than in like a traditional hyaluronic acid so it mm -hmm. binds moisture to your skin so it's not stripped and i just love it it's such a beautiful consistency and it has in here so we don't use any fragrance in cora we only use aromatherapy and this has aromatherapy of rose geranium and basil and those are anti-anxiety um it's an anti-anxiety blend so that you feel like really like calm and soothed at the same time yeah you're... i think that's the thing with all the products nothing to me smells synthetic or fake or yeah it all just smells fake. natural and beautiful that's another thing i really love about the products they're very pure and one thing that i like to do after that cleanser is use the turmeric two-in-one scrub in the shower and it just like exfoliates your skin and sloths away any dead skin cells. It has um, rosehip seeds and papaya enzymes in there. I'm getting a lot of reflection from these beautiful um, yeah, crystal inspired jars. <laughs> See that? I'm like, oh, hello. <laughs> hello, yeah. Um, so anyway, this scrub, it's like a turmeric color and it's basically you know you can decide how deep you want to go with the scrub you can be really gentle or you can even leave it on as a mask i like that's why it's a two-in-one yeah that's what i did last night in the bath i just had it left it on had a bit of a yeah. read and yes. then just washed it off it was great <laughs> it's amazing and it smells so good because you've got that peppermint aromatherapy there's a little bit of lavender in there so it's kind of invigorating but also soothing at the same time and that is like i think a must-have that everyone should try is this yes yeah. yeah for sure and then when i get out of the shower i i'll use our body wash as well um and i use that on our whole family um yeah. it's good for kids and my husband uses it and my husband is actually obsessed with this scrub this scrub is really great for men it prevents the ingrowns in their beard i might not tell my other half that because i think if i do it'll all be gone he's got a thing of going in my beauty products i tell you so i might might just keep, keep this one to myself <laughs> it's really good for that and it's really good for just it's like a facial in a tube and you see instant results with this turmeric mask yes. And then I get out of the shower and I love to use our minty mist. I was about to say, ooh, this it's one got, is cute. It's got a little aquamarine crystal in the bottom. And it just, it has Palo Santo in there to clear any energy, to just kind it's, of reset your day. And the scent is, it just is so relaxing and calming. I think, because you can wear it sort of on its own, over makeup, under makeup, but it's a good one to have on your desk. Oh, yeah, yeah. Your bag. and energy and like i'm all about energy and it's got that little aquamarine crystal in here so as well as being infused with the rose quartz you've got the extra added benefit of the aquamarine and you kind of shake it and you spray it and you feel that energy clearing little ritual and that invigoration as well with the little bit of mint in there yeah and um rosemary i love it also, Miranda, just before we run out of time, um, I, we got sent in quite a lot of questions from you, but yes. a lot of people are asking, what's next? Are we going to get supplements, sheet masks? Uh, you know, what, what do you think's next for Core Organics? Oh, my goodness. So this year we launched already four products, um, the Milky Mushroom, the Mist, and the last two, these beautiful little jars. With the yeah, milk. my favourite. It's the cream and the eye cream. And next year, we have another three products, but I never like to talk about them until they're actually here. Yeah. Um, but we are very excited about extending the line and evolving the line. For now, we are primarily focused on skincare um, because I've, I'm just very much into skincare and building that. Like it's really hard to make certified organic makeup like the technology yeah. isn't there yet and it's actually really challenging to make certified organic shampoo but yeah. the technology thank goodness is there with skincare and that's what i'm so excited about because your skin is the largest organ on your body what you put on your skin sinks in yeah. and when you use a certified organic product you're getting there's like 
the Cambridge study shows that you're getting up to 60% more antioxidants in a certified organic ingredient as opposed okay. to a non-certified organic ingredient. And that's why our products are like getting such incredible results for people's skin. Um, and we do all of our consumer studies and the clinical trials. And I, I just love that they're like super active ingredients. Yeah. No, I can really imagine you sort of going into makeup but doing it in a more organic way and, you know, having all those skin benefits within products because that's what you the brand is just so amazing at. So fingers crossed. <laughs> Oh, someone says they don't use a foundation now that they've started using the turmeric glow moisturizer. Well, there you go. It's so good, this moisturizer. It, yeah, yeah, for me, I'd say if anyone right has tried anything yet. Yeah. Anti-aging, yeah. Yeah, this is definitely my favorite. Um, and over on Harrods Beauty, um, it's actually September is our female founder month. Um, and I just wanted to ask you what advice you'd give to aspiring female business owners, um, who may, you know, just starting out in their career or what's the best bit of advice you've ever been given that you could share? I really feel as a female founder, I have relied heavily on my intuition and my gut instincts. And that's something that has been a guiding force for me in my life. Mm -hmm. And I think sometimes we can dismiss that. And I think it's really important to listen to that, like listen to that like deep pull within your heart and don't be don't be thinking too much about like this is what I should do or this is what the market is looking for you really need to follow your intuition and trust your gut and when I've done that um that's when the magic happens for me yes. and that's like like when people are like oh you need to make this and you need to make that because the this is what the audience, like, this is what the consumers are asking for. I'm like, well, actually, I really want to make this. Like, with this turmeric scrub, everyone on my team was like, I don't know, it's a little too aggressive. And actually, like, people, this is like a cult beauty favorite. It's won multiple awards. And it's, yes. It's, people just love it. I guess, yeah, following your heart, and, and you, you do heart. talk about that often, is that you just, you know, this is your brand and you've got to be 100% true to yourself, which I love, and it, it clearly shows. Yeah. Um, so that's what I love. So, Oh, Miranda, it's been absolutely amazing to chat to you. Um, it was so lovely talking with you. Thank tried you. very hard not to fangirl the whole way through, but, you know, here we are. <laughs> but thank you so much. And annoying about the hiccup at the beginning, but we, we made it through, and, um, yeah, thank you for going live on your handle. And, yeah, I absolutely love that. And everyone... You can buy, um, in the UK, you can get Core Organics at both our H, H Beauty stores and on harrods.com. So, I mean, I'd buy the, I'd buy the lot if I were you, because it's great. <laughs> <laughs> um, but thank you so much, Amanda. Hopefully we'll get to speak in the near future. And yeah, it's been great. Lovely speaking to you. Have a wonderful day. You too. Bye. Bye. Bye.